Hello, today we are going to read 1 Chronicles chapter 20, continuing continuing the uh, the account of the victorious campaigns of David's army against those who disrespected, disobeyed or defied David and the enhancement of his power as a sign of divine approbation. God approves of David because David is pure in his motivations. We know, of course, from elsewhere in the scripture that he was a human with human flaws who did wrong things. But it's clear from what we read in Chronicles that overall he was God's man and that he was blessed by God very greatly because of it. First Chronicles chapter 20. This is God's word. And it came to pass that after the year was expired, at that time that kings go out to battle, Joab led forth the power of the army and wasted the country of the children of Ammon and came and besieged Rabbah. But David tarried at Jerusalem and Joab smote Rabbah and destroyed it. And David took the crown of their king from off his head and found it to weigh a talent of gold. And there were precious stones in it and it was set upon David's head. And he brought also exceeding much spoil out of the city. And he brought out of the people that were in it and cut them with saws and harrows of iron and with axes. Even so dealt David with all the cities of the children of Ammon, and David and all the people returned to Jerusalem. And it came to pass after this that there arose war at Gezer with the Philistines, at which time Sibachai the Hushathite she slew Sippai, that was of the children of the giant, and they were subdued. And there was war again with the Philistines, and in Halon the son of Jer slew Elamai the brother of Goliath the Gittite, whose spear staff was like a weaver's beam. And yet again there was war at Gath, where was a man of great stature, whose fingers and toes were four and twenty, six in each hand and six in each foot, and he was also the son of the giant. But when he defied Israel, Jonathan the son of Shimea, David's brother, slew him. These were born unto the giant in Gath, and they fell by the hand of David and by the hand of his servants. <laughs>